Today's letter is from Victor. Victor writes, Dear Girls Leadership, Yesterday, when I went to pick up my daughter from after school, she was in tears. I kept trying to give advice, but she said I didn't understand. I was making it worse. What am I supposed to do? Victor, this is probably the most common question that we get from parents. Most parents' typical first instinct is to want to get involved. They want to solve the problem for their daughter. But when you do that, when you get involved, girls tell us that you tend to make it worse. If you make it worse, they're less likely to come home and keep telling you when they've had a bad day. And more important than solving this conflict is staying connected to your daughter. So I'm going to encourage you to try to do something a little tough and not try to take away her pain. Let her sit with it. When you do this, you're sending your daughter a very important long-term message. Imagine for a moment that your daughter is like a weeble wobble. When she comes home from school and she's upset, that weeble wobbles down for the count. When you push her back up, when you write the weeble wobble, you're sending her the message she needs you. She can't do this on her own. But when you step back and give her the time and space to write herself, she learns that she can do this all by herself. So what are you supposed to do? We've asked girls and they tell us time and time again what they want is really simple. It's a hug. They want to know you understand. Then you ask them this really tricky question. The question is, what do you think you could do in this situation? She might say, I don't know. She might come up with terrible answers. That's all right. Just let her start brainstorming. She will teach herself that in a moment when she thought she had no options, she's got lots of options. So remember, when your daughter comes home from school and she's upset, try to hold yourself back and not solve the problem for her. Give her a hug. Tell her that you understand and ask her what she wants to do to solve this problem for herself. If you've got more questions, check out girlsleadership.org.